Hello and welcome to Dia's Fun Play. In today's video, let's learn what is air pollution and what are the ways to reduce air pollution. Air pollution is a mixture of unwanted solid particles and gases in the air. Emissions from automobiles, exhaust from factories, dust, pollen and mold spores may be suspended as particles in the air. Some air pollutants are poisonous. Inhaling them can lead to several health issues. People with heart or lung disease, senior citizens and children are at greater risk from air pollution. Air pollution isn't just outside. The air that you inhale inside the buildings can also be polluted and affect your health. Burning fossil fuels releases poisonous gases and chemicals into the air. Carbon dioxide and methane raises the earth's temperature and are responsible for climatic change. Smog and soot are the two most prevalent types of air pollution. Smog occurs when emissions from burning fossil fuels react with sunlight. Soot is made up of tiny particles of chemicals, smoke, dust or allergens in the form of gas or solids that are carried in the air and travel long distances. The sources of smog and soot are similar. Both come from vehicle emissions, factories, power plants or anything that combusts fossil fuels such as coal, gas or natural gas. The tiny particles in soot is very dangerous because they can penetrate the lungs and bloodstream and worsen bronchitis and lead to heart attacks and even death in some cases. Smoke can irritate the eyes and throat and also damage the lungs, especially in children and senior citizens. It's even worse for people who have asthma or allergies and other respiratory problems. Benzene can cause eye, skin and lung irritation in the short term and blood disorders in the long term. Lead and mercury are a few of the most hazardous pollutants in the air. Lead in small amounts can affect children's IQ and their ability to learn. Large amounts of lead can damage children's brains and kidneys too. Mercury affects the central nervous system. The less gasoline we burn, the more we are helping ourselves and the environment by reducing the air pollution and harmful effects of climatic change. Whenever possible, you can walk, ride a bicycle or take public transportation. Choose cars that are fuel efficient or better, choose an electric car. You can grow some air purifying plants like snake plant, areca palm, spider plant, peace lily etc. inside your living space to purify the indoor air naturally. Minimize or avoid the use of plastics and do not burn plastics. Dispose of plastics in a proper way. Thousands of sea animals are dying every day because of the plastic waste in the oceans. Try not to use your car or your two-wheeler as much as possible. Do not use your car or your two-wheeler for short distances. And do not forget to keep your cars and two-wheelers in tip-top condition. A car or a two-wheeler that is not maintained well can consume a lot of fuel, thereby increasing the air pollution and increasing your fuel costs. Do not keep your car or your two-wheeler idle for a long time. Turn off the engine if it's not needed. Don't burn your garbage. Dispose of garbage in a safe way. Turn off your air conditioner if not needed. Try to minimize the use of air conditioners. Try to use your electrical appliances in a smart way. Run your dishwasher and washing machine in a fully loaded condition. Do not use your dishwasher or your washing machine just for one or two items. Always use energy efficient light bulbs in your home and office. Try to save energy in all possible ways. Also try to switch to renewable energy. You can consider solar energy or wind energy for your home electricity needs. Also try to plant as much as trees as possible. Try to grow your own food and vegetables in your rooftop. Rooftop vegetable gardening is becoming popular nowadays. Like packaged water bottles, packaged air bottles can soon hit the market if this problem is not addressed right now. So try to spread the word to your friends and families about air pollution and the effects of air pollution and the ways to reduce air pollution. Let's fight the air pollution together. Let's go green and save earth. Thanks for watching BS1 Play. See you in the next video. Subscribe for more videos. Why don't subscribe right here, right now. Don't forget to press the bell icon. The choice is yours. Yes, from play.